Here is what Screen Leap's home page looks like. Who is that smiling woman? Could it be the mummy? No, the patron did specify a three-headed mummy, and I only see one here. The woman in this picture is probably the librarian. The reason she looks so happy is because she didn't realize we had so many new horror films. Okay, put yourself in that librarian's shoes. You've just done a catalog search. Now you want to show the patron the results on your screen instead of just telling her what you found. How are you going to make this happen? First, you ask the patron if she has an internet connection where she is. She replies that she does. Great! The next step is to give her the URL for ScreenLeap. Let's pause to let our hypothetical patron get to that site. Okay, are you on the ScreenLeap site, dear patron? Great! Notice the sign-in link in the upper right corner. You, the librarian, would need to be signed into your account in order to be able to initiate the screen sharing. The system will generate a nine-digit code that only you can see. Why is the word instantly in bold print? The nice thing about this software is that the viewer will be able to see your computer screen without having to take the time to download anything. You give her the nine-digit code over the telephone. Once the patron is on this home page, all she has to do is type that code in the box at the top of the screen. Then she clicks the green screen share button and she is now looking at your computer screen. Notice the picture of the computer monitor. If I choose to share my entire screen, the patron will be able to see my entire desktop just as it appears here. If I only want the patron to see the catalog results, I can limit the screen share to a particular application rather than my entire screen.